today is a very exciting video. I'm switching over my closet today. I am so excited. I love switching my closet and it's kind of become like a thing that I film it every time. Um, so it's actually really warm here in Toronto now. It was, we had a few like really warm days and then we had like, some cold days and like a windstorm. Um, but now it's just kind of staying like really consistent. So I'm pretty confident in being able to switch all my stuff out. Um, I already went through all of my fall winter clothes and donated the things that I'm not going to be wearing. So um, I'm not going to bore you with that stuff because no one wants to look at winter clothes anymore. Um, so I'm just going to quickly like time lapse me taking stuff out of my closet and then I'm going to be bringing in all of my spring stuff which I have a feeling I'm going to be getting rid of a lot of stuff. This past weekend I like literally deep cleaned my entire room and closet. I literally took out like all the cabinets um, and like shelving and stuff that's in the bottom of my closet and just like vacuumed everything. So I'm like everything is just ready for spring. I'm so excited. So let's just get started. So first things first, this is my OOTD. I just have this like roughly um, yellow top from Forever 21 and then I have this skirt from H&M it's just like an A-line like denim skirt um, and then I have these like knee-high socks which in hindsight this is really not like a springy outfit I probably should have worn something more springy but whatever so I think I'm gonna start out with my clothes rack that has all of my dresses on it um, I do have some like spring pieces obviously like stuff like this and this that just I kind of bought throughout the season So I pretty much got rid of like all the coats that were hanging up here and then I went through the tops and these are kind of the ones that I could wear like if it's like a chillier night like say this red one it's not really like a seasonal top um, you can kind of wear it all year round so I just keep it there in case like I want to go out like at night or something like for dinner and it's like a little bit chillier um, and then I just kept these like four denim jackets I know this one has like fur but it's pink so I can still kind of wear it in the spring and then this one has the shearling on it but it's just on the uh, on the collar. So now I'm just gonna go through all of the skirts and then like my thinner coats back there and see what I keep. everything that was hanging and I took out everything that is from like fall and winter and I'm gonna slowly start bringing things from up um, from downstairs just because I have like no more room in my room to put things um, so I'm gonna start with everything that was in garment bags so everything that hangs and then I'm gonna start with like sweaters and shoes and stuff that's like up there I'm very slowly going through my little packages when I store stuff downstairs I kind of just like layer them up on one hanger just so I don't have like a million hangers downstairs this dress is like it's cute but I didn't really wear it all that much last season when I got it so I think I'm gonna put this one in the donation pile first item in the donation pile guys this I'm keeping because it's so cute I wore this for um, Toronto Fashion Week and it was so 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 cute I love this I love orange this dress like it's really cute but I've worn it like a hundred and fifty million times I think I'm gonna be getting rid of this dress uh, I wore this for I want to say this is for like athletic, it was not this short, but I swear I wore this for like athletic banquet or something when I was in high school. Um, I was not in a sports team, I literally just bought a ticket, but uh, it's really cute and for the time it was really really cute, but I probably will never wear this ever again. Definitely keeping this coat, I swear this is like one of my favorite coats. It's so cute. Like look at this color and the little slit at the back just like ah. This dress is really, really pretty. I don't really wear it that often, so I think this is gonna be my last season with it, and then we'll see kind of how much I wear it. Then, last thing in that bag is my beloved baby blue trench coat, which is like my life. Like, I have to sew one of these buttons so it's like coming undone. But can we just discuss how cute this little trench coat is? Like, ah. It's the cutest. So the way that all the dresses were hanging was kind of bothering me, so I kind of started to color coat things. I'm not really sure about like this area right now, but I guess it just kind of depends on what else I find in all these bags. Um, I'm also not sure if I'm going to keep the dresses here or if I'm going to put small jackets there because I have a lot of dresses, so I don't know if it's going to be too much for the garment, uh, the garment rack. 
So I think I came to the conclusion that I'm gonna take out all like the more um, like gown-like dresses like this one and like this one and this really big puffy one down here um, and I'm gonna put them inside my closet I think that just makes a little bit more sense the closets looking a little bit more full since the last time you guys saw it um, I have some kind of like tweed coats here and then some longer spring coats over there um, I did put some of the gowns kind of like back there um, and then I have some pants like the they're like kind of like a like a soft fabric kind of pant then I have some long uh, midi skirts then I have some just plain skirts, uh, and then these are the blouses that I currently have. That massive pile there at the bottom, that's my donate pile, which I'm doing really, really well. It's actually a lot of things that I'm donating. I'm finding that a lot of the things that I'm going to be donating are going to be uh, in the big Tupperwares that I'm going to be bringing soon. This pile, which is like my maybe pile, I'm not sure if I'm going to donate it or not, so I'm going to try some of these on and show you guys and see what you guys think. Okay, this doesn't match like at all, but I mean, it's really, really cute. It puffs out. I just, I don't know how many times I'd wear it really. Okay, now I have this piece which kind of is like sequins. Um, I thrifted this a while ago and I never really wore it. Um, I think it'd be really cute for like a night out if I have, imagine if this skirt was um, like a black skirt. And then I have this. Next I have this dress which I think I'm gonna end up donating because it's a little short. Like I kind of like things that kind of flare out a little bit more. Um, the sleeves are really cute. It has like these little bell sleeves to them but my closet's looking really, really good. I'm done with all the dresses and then I just kind of started organizing um, all the hanging bits because I don't have anything else left to bring up from downstairs that hangs. All I have is like big Tupperwares which would be like for the sweaters, the shoes, and then like tops and stuff that would be in my dresser. So that's the next step. It's uh, What time is it right now? I already had lunch but it's about 4 o'clock so I think I'm going to start bringing up some Tupperwares and then make myself coffee and then just kind of go through them with you guys. So I have a couple of these like massive Tupperware filled with shoes and like tops and stuff so we're gonna go through it and but first some coffee I think I'm gonna donate this I don't know I'm gonna put this in the maybe pile I feel like I'm gonna end up keeping all of these shoes I can't say no to these shoes these are gorgeous these as well with a little strap when do you ever find orange shoes okay why do I have two pairs of baby blue shoes not sure they're a different shape so I'm gonna keep them okay next I have another one of these big Tupperwares. Sorry, it's really heavy. Okay. So I have this yellow skirt, which is more of like a bodycon skirt, which I don't really wear anymore. So I think I'm gonna donate that. This skirt, I feel like it's just kind of basic. I don't really think I'm gonna wear it anymore. I have this blouse that's black and it has kind of like a little ruffly neck. So I think I'm gonna donate this one. This one's really cute actually, it's a, it's a little bit more different, it has like these other like denim patches on it which I think is really cool. So I'm gonna keep this one for sure. I believe this is my last little Tupperware. So let's see what's in here. I have these shorts, I don't really wear them, I like the print but let's be real. I have this little fringy skirt, um, I really like it, I wish it fit me better so I think I'm just gonna donate it. Of course I'm hanging on to this little baby yellow. Um, purse. Oh my god, guys. Okay, do you remember my last haul? I had that like baby yellow skirt with a yellow baby cardigan. Imagine if I add this to it, like, is that too much baby yellow? But I feel like it might just be like enough baby yellow. It's fall stuff. I don't know why this is doing here. I think I'm gonna donate this. I didn't really wear it. I have my beloved, like, <laughs> blue and red crab sweater that literally every time that I wear this, someone makes fun of me because of it. And it just, like, I don't know why. I think it's so great. And like, like, I would get rid of it because I don't really wear it, but the times that I do wear it, I have a lot of fun. So I'm just going to hang on to it just because it's fun. Um, I have one of my favorite bags. I have this pineapple purse, and I just think it's really, really cool. My dad got it for me when he went to Spain, and it's just like the greatest thing ever. <laughs> I am officially done switching over my closet. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a tour even though I, I feel like I've done this tour like three times already. So when you first walk in, there's a few little like 
handbags kind of just hanging there. They're just kind of random. I don't really use those. Um, and then I have the garment rack with all of my spring dresses. I think it looks really, really cute. I tried to color code it as best as I could. And at the bottom, I have another backpack. And then I have this little furry thing, like a fur um, scarf that I have to do something with. I don't want to leave that there in the summer, but you know, whatever. Um, and then we move over to my closet. I have my little Prada matching set thing that I still don't know where to store. I might just like stick it in my closet for now. And then I have my like really massive faux fur pink um, jacket that I still don't know where to store either. I feel like I don't have enough room downstairs for it. But anyway, we're gonna open the closet. Da da da. Back there, I have some spring like coats. And then I have some like denim jackets and then like tweed jackets. And then I have all of my blouses here. And then I have in this little small section, I have all of my um, short skirts and then my long midi skirts. And then I have like flowy pants and this one really cool pair of um, jeans that I can't really fold. Then I have all of my rompers here. And then back there, I just kind of have all of these like uh, gowns or like event dresses back there. I don't have that many, but they're really heavy for me to put them in the garment rack outside. And then moving up to the top, I have all of my black shoes. And then going to like patterned ones and then nudes and then grays and whites. And then down here, I have like my little straw bag back there. I have a little yellow one, my pineapple. And then I have some more shoes with like blue and green, pink, orange, coral, red, leopard. And then I have like a random pair of like maroon platforms back there. Door, I just hung my little houndstooth like dress and jacket set and then behind it I have a little cotton um, petticoat uh, on the door I have backpacks as always with my little fluffs at the top and my little sailor hat that I like literally never wear I want to wear it more often and then panning sorry I'm making you dizzy on the other door I have more backpacks and then like little crossbody bags um, and then I have more bags there at the bottom. Down here I have all of the shoes, like the little flats or like small heeled shoes. And then on the top shelf I have some small little handheld bags. And then down on the bottom shelf I have all my shorts. Um, in this box I just have all my winter scarves and hats and stuff so that just kind of stays there. And then on top I have some more bags. And then my boots that I really never like move them just because I have the space so I don't have anywhere else to put them. And then my Seventeen magazine prom edition from when I went to prom, so I'm saving that for if I have a daughter. Grand old mess right here is my donation pile. Doo -doo. Yeah, it's a lot. Hopping over that, I have my dresser, which on the top shelf, on the top drawer, sorry, um, I just kind of have a few little things like striped printed tops um, and then some lacy tops. Um, random like one colored or t-shirts and then I have like some thin sweaters there a couple of dresses that I don't really feel like I had to hang uh, and then I have like another little knit sweater section there and then just cardigans so yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I'm so happy that I was actually able to sort out and get it all done in one day. Usually it takes me a couple of days to switch over my closet just because I'm usually doing other things like in between. Um, but I was kind of, I had a full whole day. So I'm like, I'm gonna aim and get it all done for today. So yay. Um, I do have this ottoman in front of my bed that has all of my summer like straw hats in it. But I thought I'm actually gonna do a collection video kind of like how I did with my braids. So that's why I didn't show it to you guys. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it make sure you check out my instagram and my blog in the description bar as always and i'll see you guys in my next video bye